Hello and welcome. I am Sachin Brahme with Avaya Serviceability Engineering. In this video, we'll see how to use the switch utility to monitor phone lines in Avaya Proactive Contact. This video is applicable to ISDN phone lines only. I have three windows open. I have a SSH session to the Proactive Contact system where I will run the switch commands. I have another SSH session on which I have displayed the dgswitch.cfg file from the config folder. You can see the ones in the ISDN protocol field which are indicating that these are ISDN lines. This demo is not applicable to non-ISDN lines where you would have seen a 0 instead of 1 in the ISDN protocol field. And I also have an IP soft phone logged in. This IP soft phone will act as the phone which we will use to monitor a phone line. Firstly, we will look at the line assign parameter from the master.cfg file. The line assign shows you the breakup of the outbound and inbound phone lines in smaller groups. We call these as regs. For example, you can see that reg 1 has outbound lines 1 to 11. Reg 2 has outbound lines 13 to 24. Reg 3 has inbound lines 25 to 28. And these lines map to the ports mentioned in the dgswitch.cfg file, the one that you see on the right hand side on the screen. So basically this helps the supervisors to assign or remove lines to a job in smaller groups. It's your choice to decide which port to use for calling yourself, but you must make sure that the port you choose is not being used by the system at that time. You can see that Rec5 has only one outbound port, that is port number 12. For our demo, we will use this port to call ourselves, and using that call, we'll monitor another phone line. It's always a good idea to have one port in your line assigned like this, which can be used for testing purposes without disturbing the jobs running on the system. Let's now connect to the switch utility using the switch command. Once you log in, you should run show ok tx err as the first command. This will make sure that your screen gets displayed with the messages only related to the commands that you run. On a live system where there are jobs running and agents working on calls, it is very important that you run this command before connecting to the digital switch. Now we will connect to the digital switch using the command init switch1 colon 2050. Here switch1 is the host name of the digital switch and 2050 is the port to connect through switch which is also known as init3. Then I do a show port for the port using which I will call myself on the IP soft phone. For this demo, we will use the outbound port number 12 which we saw in the line assigned parameter. So we will check what is the decimal port address for that outbound port and you can see that it's 291. So the command here will be show port space percentage 291. We do this for displaying the ISDN events happening on this port when we place the call. Let's place the call on this port now and the command will be I call space percentage 291 space percentage the outpulse rule we'll use the outpulse rule number 13 for this example space 1 and space the phone number which is 21001 for my IP soft phone. When I press enter you can see the call coming to my IP soft phone I will answer that and say hello it shows a connect and a live voice detected. So now that we have called ourselves, let's see how to monitor another phone line. Depending on the requirement, you can choose to monitor an outbound line or an agent headset line. We will choose an agent headset line here. Let's choose headset port number 18 for which the decimal port address is 336. The command will be monitor space percentage 291 space percentage 336 where 291 is the decimal port address of the port which you have used to call yourself and 336 is the decimal port address of the line that you are monitoring. When I press enter you will see the connect port message and on my phone I will be able to hear everything that goes on on that headset port. Once you are done with monitoring make sure that you disconnect the monitoring by typing the command disc space percentage 291 that is the decimal port address of the port that you have used to call yourself. Then finally for hanging up the line you do a hang space percentage 291. And that concludes this demonstration. 
Thank you for watching this video. For any questions or feedback, you may write to us at mentor at or at Avaya Mentor on Twitter. Thank you for choosing Avaya.